Human design for your company, team, or organization. Human design what? Yes, exactly. Human design knowledge is still not mainstream in nowadays world. However, the amount of potential and impact it carries is mind-blowing. In this video, you will be introduced to five major benefits a human design system can offer to your company, team, or organization to create more supportive, more authentic, more productive, and more inflow work environment. In today's fast-paced business world, companies, teams, and organizations are constantly seeking for new methods how to enhance the effectiveness and efficiency of their employees in order to stay on the winning edge of the game. While traditional factors like qualifications, expertise, and work ethic are vital, they are no longer enough. Many organizations now turn to and utilize personality frameworks such as MBTI and DISC to evaluate their employees' strengths and weaknesses, aiming for improved productivity, interpersonal relationships, and overall morale. However, the most overlooked aspect is the energetic element. Scientific studies have revealed that the universe is primarily composed of energy and everything at the subatomic level vibrates with a certain frequency. Additionally, our bodies generate significant amounts of energy forming an aura that surrounds us within approximately two to three arms length. This unique electrical and magnetic aura differs for each individual and greatly influences our interactions with others. The scientific understanding of this aura dynamics is explained through a system called the human design. Now, let's take a deep look on already mentioned five major benefits a human design can offer to your organization, company, or team. Let's talk about benefit number one, which is improved teamwork. Through the understanding of each energy type and its differences, you can significantly improve the work in teams and create more efficient teams by assigning roles that best suit each individual through honoring their unique design. There are four main types with one subtype in human design system, namely manifestors, reflectors, projectors, and generators with a subtype of manifesting generators. Each of the energy types own different qualities and operates differently in the workplace. For example, generators thrive in roles that allow them to use their physical energy and hands-on skills and when they can respond to what is assigned for them. Projectors, on the other hand, are excellent at guiding and advising others, tweaking inefficient energy and offering the bird-eyed view. Now, Let's get to benefit number two, which is improved efficiency and productivity. It is very important to understand that not everyone has the same access to life force energy. Being aware of how much access to energy each of the team members has, how to use it wisely and how to avoid energy leaks is incredibly important for the quality of their performance, productivity and efficiency. Human design gives powerful insights into how to wisely manage energy so that each person's unique energy capacity, needs, and limits can be honored. For example, projectors and generators' access to life force energy would be completely different due to the structure and mechanics of their type. Understanding that, keeping that in mind, and supporting personalized work schedule while not overloading let's say, for instance, projectors when they are low in energy and support the rest periods or create more spaciousness in working days can have a direct impact on increased efficiency, productivity, and even increased creativity. Let's move to benefit number three, more authenticity, more self-acceptance and confidence. Supporting authenticity of each person, letting them feel accepted and understood directly connects to their increased confidence, which results in better performance and better results. Once a person is given a permission slip to be fully themselves and feels understood, 
self-doubt will disappear and self-acceptance finds its place. Human design opens the door to developing the best relationship with oneself and therefore building a strong foundation for bringing the best self into work environment too. Benefit number four, decisions with no regret. This is a big one. We live in a society where we are literally told to make every single decision with our mind. In general, we are completely disconnected from our bodies and our intuition. Human design encourages a new approach. Probably one of the biggest benefits of human design in general, in my humble opinion, is this different decision-making strategy. It offers, human design offers an insight into making decisions based on each person's body consciousness. Let me explain or let me elaborate. By allowing that each of us make decisions differently, by allowing that our logic wired minds aren't always the authority, so to speak, that we've historically assumed them to be, we enter a completely different and a completely new dimension of decision making that is authentic and regret free. For instance, person with emotional authority may need to wait for their initial excitement or fear to settle before making a clear-headed choice, while someone with a sacral authority may want to tune into their body guts reactions. There's more to say into this, but I'm going to leave it at that so it doesn't get more confusing. Let's move and let's wrap up with the benefit number five, just to make sure there are much more benefits. Uh, I just wanted to round it up to five. So this is the one that we're going to end up with. More inner peace and fulfillment. Overall, once the members of your organization or team feel seen, understood and accepted for their uniqueness, they experience more inner peace, more fulfillment and joy, which results in better performance, which ultimately brings better results, right? This might be not so obvious and rather abstract benefit, yet in my opinion, definitely one of the most significant ones. Now, what I want to say last, but definitely not least, is that human design isn't prescriptive. It will never tell you exactly what the title of each team member should be or how to map their specific career path from A to Z. No. But, or however, it will help you understand yourself and others better. Human design system will help you understand yourself and others better. It will deepen your compassion for the complexity of everyone you meet. And this itself is so important. And we need to make sure that this is considered more and more in the dynamics of teams. Uh, You know, when there is a project going on, if there is just more people, more team members within each company or organization. If you are a company, team or organization and you are keen to implement or experiment with human design in your company, in your team or in your organization, then let's connect. Let's schedule core, let's meet and let's talk how we can cooperate so that your company, team or organization thrives on the authenticity of each person. The link for connecting and booking a call below in the description.